Cape Cast. Howdy, folks. Welcome to Cape Cast, the official webcast of the Cape Cod Times. And I've just been called up to the Red Sox because of my big Barnstable Bat Company bat. Let's see how they're made. Batter up. We are here at the legendary Barnstable Bat Company in Centerville. And Tom, what goes on in this magic woody room around us? Uh, well, we make baseball bats out of wood. Hmm, curious. Now, how does it all start? Does it just come from a tree, or do you, do you get in a hunk of wood? Where does it start? Uh, what we do is uh, we receive from uh, various mills across the northeast of the United States uh, Three by three pieces of wood, approximately 36, 37 inches long, uh, which we will turn into baseball bats. What kind of wood do you use? We use ash, maple, and birch. How does it become a bat? What are the steps that are necessary? Well, what we'll do is we'll take this block, run it through a rounding machine, and turn it into this uh, two and seven eighths dowel here. And then from that point, we take it and weigh it, and that will determine what type of bat we're going to make. Then we uh, program our lathe, which is computerized, uh, to produce the bat that we've chosen to make from that particular piece of wood. Now, how long does it take uh, for you to make one bat from here all the way to the finished product? Um, the finished product's about 12 minutes. pretty much a state-of-the-art piece of equipment. It's four years old. It will turn approximately 40 bats per hour. Uh, we take and draw all the bats on the computer, uh, store them, and we have approximately 200 different shapes and lengths in the computer. After the bat is taken out of the lathe, uh, we sand it and it gets sanded six times to a very, very high polished uh, finish. Then we trim the ends off uh, because there is a portion that you have to remove. Uh, and we do that on a bandsaw. Then we polish off the ends and then they're dipped in a uh, clear lacquer and dried once sanded, labeled, and then re-dipped again in the lacquer to give it a high gloss finish. So Thomas brings the bats into me, and then I take the order and I put the name on, whatever inscription they want. There's something beautiful about a bat beyond the fact that it whacks the heck out of a ball if you swing it right. There's a, a beauty to it. Well, I, I've always liked wood, and uh, the wood we use is always of exceptional quality, and uh, they're pretty in themselves. Now, Tom, who are your customers? Because there are those aluminum bats out there. Well, we uh, sell bats across the country and all over the world. And our customers are generally high-ranking amateurs, high school players, and older amateur players. And we supply a lot of bats to the Cape Cod Baseball League. We were in Major League Baseball for uh, eight years. Who were some of the major leaguers that used your bats? Um... Nomar, Mo Vaughn, Darren Bragg, uh, Chuck Knobloch, Luis Soho, uh, Sh uh, Shane Spencer, Jose Canseco, Geronimo Barroa, Mike Bordick. Just, uh, we made bats for over 400 Major League uh, players. Cape Cass.